I go by the name L A Y C O N. I just got drunk. I'm not going to take any one of these. Welcome, people. I go by the name L A Y C O N and it's Kanye, sir. And I'm inside cracks, about to play the Never Have I Ever game. I'm pretty sure I'm going to do well, to the best of my ability. Never have I ever fallen in love at first sight. I have never. Never have I ever accidentally sent someone to the hospital. No, I've never. Never have I ever cried over a failed relationship. No, I've never. You think they they wise? I'm not going to take any one of these. Okay. Never have I ever been sad over a failed relationship. Ah, uh, obviously I have been. You just that was, that question was in there. Yeah, Is that that question was in there? You? That question wasn't Should there, I please. Show you? you can't put feel cry and sad at the same time. Obviously, you'll be sad. So why were you in the relationship if you are not going to be sad? Never have I ever kissed more than one person in 24 hours. <laughs> 24 hours, ah, come on. <laughs> oh, oh, Miss Marky, oh, Miss <laughs> So it wasn't a truth of that game and I had to kiss uh, two different girls in the space of like a couple of minutes. There are other ones, but let's just go with the truth of their one. That's much more relatable. Never have I ever tried marijuana. Ah! It's global economy. What is you I went to Delta. I went to see Scar. Scar is a good friend of mine. I went to see him and he was just raving on about this guy that makes pancakes with with marijuana. <laughs> I went to the guy's house. So the guy made the pancake. You know, pancake, the normal color is supposed to be yellow. This pancake was black because <laughs> he had mixed it with so much. So we ate the pancake and I just, I, I mean, I was in another world, basically. Never have I ever tried something I saw in a pornographic movie. <laughs> <laughs> that lot of people, you know. <laughs> I mean, the whole point of going to watch it so you can get something to try. <laughs> ah! Let's see if the formation will be complete. This goalkeeper for defenders. The story of what? I'm, I'm sorry, I've just downed. Five shots of vodka. So just you need to actually remind me of what oh, what, what am I doing here first of all? Okay, never have I ever tried. Which game is this? Where are we? You are tracks, <laughs> baby. You are playing inside tracks. Never have I ever. That's the game. So which story am I supposed to tell you? You're going to tell us the pornographic thing hmm? you saw and you tried out. Oh yeah, on Twitter one midnight, and I saw somebody said TL asleep, and then I. So the picture. Ah, ah, this is nice. I clicked on the person's account, and I found out that the person has been retweeting some type of videos. I'm not going to tell you with the person. I now entered the account of one of the um, videos that she retweeted, and I saw a particular video. I watched it. Like, yeah. So the next time I met with my other half. I was like, guy, so I saw something, I want us to try it too. And I went. It's something that man and woman do in the private sector of their house or of their life. Sometimes they do it in the car. You get the gist of it. Exactly. Never have I ever tried to make an ex jealous. Ha. Drink up. Yeah. <laughs> At the moment where you guys say yeah i need to i need to be alone you need to be alone that kind of thing you like kind of like wanna um let the person know that you're fine even though you're not fine <laughs> never have i ever used a sex toy ah <laughs> so ah oh my god that one that you you wear and then uh, there's this in there then you put in and then it vibrates 
it's just a whole complicated shit and then it has remotes that you press as you're going when i came out of the house a lot of people were sending me presents so somebody sent me sex toy first off i had to google how to use it but then i had somebody that was very dear to me i immediately she saw it she was like oh yeah i'm going to teach you how to use it because she knows how to use it Yes, definitely, I do. Never have I ever lied about my relationship state. Ah, <laughs> those days. <laughs> women used to, women used to look for tenants. <laughs> I had a couple of chicks, yeah, I was with, and then, then, you see another girl and you're like, but then you're just trying to talk, just trying to talk and see, Nothing, no bad intentions. But you know, say if you talk, say you get babe, this babe go. So you, you you just want to lie, you just lie that lie. You don't need to lie the lie, but you just lie the lie, and it's a bad thing. So people are not supposed to be doing that because if you're with somebody, you just stay with the person. There's no need to gallivant around. Never have I ever been to a strip club. I have. So I don't get it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> hey! Ten shots! Hey! So my cousin was having his birthday and he took me to a strip club. I'm not going to even lie. I drank absolute vodka and I got high. Then I was now just still one of the strippers. Yeah, I was telling her that oh, you look actually pretty. Why are you doing this kind of job? This kind of thing. I didn't know when I turned to motivational speaker there. And then the girl was just like, oh, what do you want? Do you want dance or not? I said I wanted dance. And then she danced with me. And then she now went to the pool. I remember that I got, I was stood up. I was dancing to one song like that. And this girl just, immediately she, I think she was spinning. She just used that shoe to hit my head. That was what made her give me a number. And then some things went down like Never have I imagined myself on the remix of a song I like. Ah, phew. plenty Woo! times. See what you people do on your face. That nobody, that nobody remix. I don't remix that for my head plenty oh. times before I even enter the house. So when I came out, it was time for the nobody remix. I was just like, man, fuck. I jump. Truth is, for every song that I like, I actually kind of imagine myself on them. What would I do? What how would I do it differently than what this person is doing? Then I write like 16 bars for every song funny enough i didn't write for nobody though but that night immediately i knew what i wanted to do i knew i wanted to do it so the formation is complete now never have i ever written a song based on personal experience yeah. i'm not going to drink yeah, now <laughs> no no drink. <laughs> i have there's a lot of songs that i wrote based off experience i'll just talk about four for me so fall for me, yes, yeah, about uh, basically telling a girl not to fall for me because if you fall for me, I would get attached. There are situations where like you see a girl and you know you like the girl. I like the girl, but I uh, just I just want you on a me and you do stuffs, but not get attached emotionally. So I'm just kind of warning you in advance. So I've kind of been in that situation a lot of times, so I could relate with it when came so that's that's like four for me it was easier for me to display you that i'm interested just in me and you getting together and kicking it rather than me and you being together emotionally that kind of thing i'm not gonna lie see now check four three three i drank everything i'm i'm, I'm in the 10 shots i just took 10 shots of a car and honestly when you see this just know that i'm I did for highway. <laughs> I mean, the game was fun. Yeah, they said a lot of things that I've never done, and they said a lot of things that I've done, and I've overdone self. But <laughs> shouts out to Cracks TV. Shouts out to Icons. I love you guys so much. Thank you for always staying behind me. Thank you for always fighting for me. I love you guys so much. You guys are the best. I go by the name L A Y C O N, and it's Kanisha Wagwan, and I'm signing now. <laughs>